nini wewe Mungu baba ye kinywa changu kimetawaliwa na sifa zako Mungu baba ukuu wako hekima yako ni kubwa na duniani chochote kitokacho kinywa ni mwangu ni sifa zako peke Welcome back, Karibu to Y254 TV. In case you're just getting to join us, this is Y in the Morning, hashtag Thursday Vibes, where we get to give you good music, great conversation, and we get to give you the juice. And talking about, I told you I had a good one. Eh? I don't lie. So the good one has come. Mm, I'm super excited. You can read from my facial expression. I am blessed. This morning to have Hilary the worshipper to make our morning this morning now to bless Pia. You know what we know wakitembea is a man now and be a man of God. Watch a baraka. Karibu sana Hilary. Asante. Thank Good you. Good to see you. Thank you. Karibu to Y254. Thank you. So ni mesema wewe ni mchungaje but wa mbina kani mbina. No I'm not a pastor. My name is Hilary, the worshipper. I'm a worship minister. Yeah, and I'm a recording artist also. Yeah. So what's the difference between worshipping and record, artists? Recording artists. Yeah. Artists, artists you're good in, in writing. Uh -huh. But minister, you're both good in, in writing and also in dispensing the life of God to people. So um, do you prefer to be called a worshipper or an artist? Uh, a worshipper, it's okay. That's why I'm Hilary the worshipper. But you know what? We're Rema. Hey, we're covered to skill not to be a In a bid, he wants. Personally, I appreciate knowing uh, Kulewatu Ametoka because mm. it's it's uh, it's an opportunity to edify mm -hmm. someone. So if you don't mind, you can tell us tell us how the journey has been mm -hmm. to becoming. Of course, you didn't wake up a lot of Hilary the worshipper. You know. <laughs> yeah, sure, sure, yeah. sure. Uh, okay. Uh, first of all, my, uh, I'm, born, uh, I'm born from a family where everybody is born again. Actually, my dad is a bishop. Pastor's kid. Pastor's kid. <laughs> anyway, and uh, by the grace of God, uh, that's where I started singing. But my singing wasn't that into, into, okay, like right now. I was just singing those, you know, those Sunday school songs, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. I used to, I used I used to sing traditional songs again. <laughs> yes, and you know Louis, the way Louis are so much deep into into yeah. I used to sing them. In fact, kuna tamzigiri in Afikanga, I'm singing them and like no 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 no. <laughs> That's not my direction, you see. So yeah, I did some secular ile pressure high school pia. But we thank God. So I think I from Ulimba enter. Huh? Ah, <laughs> see, see, <laughs> see, you people, the way you were so loud in high school. Yeah, you know, yeah. Uh, yeah. But I uh, thank God you influenced your take away, you take away from God. But I uh, started singing when I was young. I thought my mom was a, was a musician. My mom was a musician. I think he was a musician. Yes. So, nikanza, nikanza. actually, I knew 
I'll be a minister because of very many opportunities that were coming my way. And uh, most of them I was ministering, even singing simple songs. And very many people are like, you're singing so well. Hey. So I knew there is something about my life that I need to dig. So I started Zilema high school, high school conferences. Unapata, unapata, watu, shule zingine zitaimba, yes, but once hizi tumekuja na tunaimba, like, there is a shift. So, I kwa ati tuna, tukona pride apana, ni kitu goda likuwa na jaribu kuniambia, this is your, this is now where you need to focus. Yeah, I remember those days, uh, tukona high school, kama tunenda high school flani, ati weekend challenge. Watu 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 ataimba, but once hizi tumefanya presentation yetu, Kwanzi hapo kuendelea ni situ ta take over. <laughs> Mbako kumusho. So I used to find myself ministering with the men of God in deliverance. They are doing the deliverance and I'm singing. And the way I'm singing, naona God and I move kwa watu. So I was like, no, 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 no. This is a different thing that God has placed in my life. So once, once, uh, now when you linga from one, don't you answer sasa kuwa serious. That's the story, yeah. Kuwa, ku, kuwa born again. Because I remember... The moment I gave my life to Christ. This is, this is, this is, this is unique by the way. Mimi siko kwa kati mtu waki preach. Atie, wale wanatubwa. No, no, no. Actually, there's a lady who was worshipping. Back then, in Shago, kwa church, nili kuanga. So, she was worshipping this song. Mata ifa yote, yata kusanyika. So, I was like, okay. And, and God. Mwame ndiyo taifa. That's Rema. I receive. <laughs> so, Yo, wakati ndo, the Holy Spirit can quicken. Mm -hmm. Now you need to give your life to Christ. You being born, you being born in a family that is born again doesn't mean you're born again. Now mm -hmm. this time. So from that time, I went to the altar. I prayed and I told God, now this is it. Na hapo ndo worship ministry ilikuwa birthed in my spirit. Yes. Wow. So from that time, na nini so ni kingianga high school. Kuingia high school hivi. Ah, nika sawa hizo story kasema hakuna pressure za sasa za, za dunda na hizo story zote. Ah. But uh, God sent a man of God. Actually he was a student. Na akakuja akaniambia, "You anijui." But akakuja mpaka kwenye nalala. Akaniamsha 5 in the morning kaniambia, "God has sent me to you that you are a worshiper and you need to start doing what God has called you to do." Hapo na nikaanza kujua, enyewe, enyewe, jona, jona hata wende kwa samaki, God bada takutafuta, utenda ni neve bado. Ye yeah, mazi, so, hivyo ndo nilianza and I started, I was singing and very many people were being blessed. Si ile tu kubless ya kuongea, mm -mm. na nikuwa form one, paka watu ngini wakua na confused kani kwa form four. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was so much, eh. I still remember God God was giving me visions of how people of how services zitakuwa before to end at a service how God would be moving and I was like God what's this so I kept on building and building and building and uh, it was great I remember ha huh, my my mom didn't know I'm singing by the way what even my dad all kwa nasikia tu so siku moja hapo akakuja AGM nakumbuka AGM zile za high school so sasa tukapepo ufala katambia nyinyi watu wa CU imbeni kwanza nyinyi mpe wangi pesa mingi sana mkiimba acha sisi watu wa kwaya tutakuja kuimba and you know kwaya music yeah. festival those days yeah. so waso kwaya soka kam wakatambia hivyo nikaambia wase wangu si twendeni we are serving god we are not here for competition to money let's just be for tulimba song moja tuliona shule yote na watu wote walikuwa wamekuja wanatuletea pesa so mimi nilikuwa napewa pesa mpaka hata nakuwa distracted na kuimba. So nilikuwa nachukua nikipeana hapo. <laughs> mpaka principal na sasa high school principal kusimama mm -hmm. na watoto wa board kusimama wanakuja huko mbele inakoanga kitu. Yeah. yeah. So it was and I realized that people are bringing money to me and they are saying you have God will take you far. Hizo ma prophecies na nini. So I realized there is something different about me. Mpaka mm -hmm. mamangu akashtuka. Anambia ah so akaenda kaambia mzai. Sasa <laughs> mzai hata hajawahi ona. So the first time I think uh, it was just it, it is an amazing journey but uh, but God I mean idea sana. My first song I wrote in high school. 
na ikatumiwa ika, ika, ika kwa weekend challenge. Oh. Mm. Tumiwa kwa weekend challenge. And people were responding. I was like, okay, so this thing is working. Yeah. So that's how my journey has been. And uh, after nimetoka uko, kuingia. That time, mata, siku na speak in tanks in QI school. But hizo yutu ziliko zinafanyika. So there's a weekend challenge we went before I left school. And this man of God was saying, uh, how many people here speak in tongues? <laughs> Over 600 people. Hakuna mtu hata mmoja lido mkono. Aja, 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 aja. Nilitoka hapo, nimeshikuwa na holy hunger. Kambia God, no. I want to speak in tongues. Yes. So I started reading materials about speaking in tongues. Watching men of God who are speaking about your topic na nini. And uh, when I joined uh, campus, God filled me with the Holy Spirit the first night, the first worship experience night. Actually, ukiangalea vizuri vitu zangu mingi zina shift you ako worship, worship, mm, worship. Yeah. Yeah. So that's the time the Holy Spirit filled me and I started speaking in tongues. Now so, from there. <laughs> so let me ask fly. you. Yes. Ulienda kampu kusoma music? No, 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 no. Human resource. I'm a manager by profession. <laughs> <laughs> what did you study? Human resource management. Why? Why not do music? Why did you not do music? No. In fact, in fact, I was to do journal, journalism or being a doctor. Mm -hmm. yeah, so I had those two options. Mm -hmm. But kwa, kwa according to Max Zango, Nanini, Navutuzi, Nikon Mepewa, Nikona, Human Resource Management. Because Nikon Apena Kaka Office here sometimes. So I like, ah, Human Resource Management. Other size in Dona, Dona Jua. It was it was a it was a divine it was a divine connection to my destiny because you see even in ministry you're managing people. Yeah. My pages, YouTube channel and everything, the comments, everything, how to deal with people. It's management also. Yeah. But uh I didn't do music and I can't do music. Yes. You don't have a manager now that you've mentioned human mm. resource management. Yes. Might that be the reason why you don't have a manager? Yeah, I'm a manager by profession. <laughs> <laughs> Will you be open to having a manager? Maybe, 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 uh, maybe my cousin. I'll train my cousin to do that for me. Why not pick someone else? No. Why? They will hack my accounts and go away. <laughs> <laughs> do you have insecurity issues? When you may build if you are laughing from nowhere, you don't know. Would you potenza? Would you potenza? Would you kuanza zero to kusema nini? See, but uh, but no, I'm training my cousin to do that because Nataka Pia nim create an opportunity, a job opportunity maybe. Yeah, as God leaves me, Najua, very many things will be flowing. But it was specific. If a man of God calls an apostle or a bishop, I'm talking with them. But if ni have a others talk us. to them, please. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but uh, but uh, yeah, it's important because yes, so we can be a bishop. Yeah, there are cases whereby very many musicians, especially in Kenya, they've they've lost they've lost opportunities because of that. Yeah. Alafu wengine wana etiquette ya kuonge. Now you see me I'm a manager by profession. I know how to talk to people. Even if it's professionally, even sp uh, spiritually, you know how to talk to people. Yeah. How do you how do you think um Music. Mm -hmm. No, I, I, I don't know if I really like calling it music industry, especially mm -hmm. when it, when we're talking about gospel. Mm -hmm. How do you think um, where we are at right now, mm. and where we where other countries are? Mm -hmm. What's the projection like? Okay, in fact, industry like Kufa Kenya, that's only ministry, my bike. Yeah, but uh, me, one thing I know with the sight of prophecy, what God is about to do in Kenya especially to worshippers. You wait and see. You tell me about it. Yeah, there's a wind that is coming that it uh, it uh, it uh, raises what to what to when you, they're doing it for God. And uh, you see how it's happening in Nigeria? Mm -hmm. That wind is coming also to Kenya. Yes. Mm -hmm. Because you see, hey, those guys, they are positioned. Kila pali, ingia TikTok utawapata huko. Alafu, God anekele mkono yao kwa vitu zinyo wanafanya. They blow up. That's what God is going to do in Kenya, especially for those, especially for the young people. Not these ones when you make established the young people, of course, like me. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You so, had to put yourself yes, in that Yes, yes. I'm part of that. I see the mystery. I see pride, by the way. I know. I know about it. So, 
good days, they're coming up on Bella. People will appreciate the gospel. I'm mm -hmm. telling you the truth. People will appreciate the gospel because it won't be just singing. People will be watching videos too, normally even on TV, and they're filled with the Holy Ghost. Me, I'm waiting for those days. I'm waiting for those days. Talk about the show, na kila mtu na pepeto na Holy Ghost. That's those are the days we are we are we are, we are coming into. But uh, what I'll I'll say is um, is um, the music is coming, and uh, especially spirit filled music coming mm. and people will appreciate the gospel but right now people just need to build position yourself everywhere on tiktok facebook do you think um gospel musicians mm. are putting effort mm. um in terms of their production mm. as compared to secular because to no longer gospel for lack of better for lack of better explanation mm. you'll find gospel musicians mtoto amemka ame record to kiwimbo and then ukimwona pile play sana shoot hiyo wimbo amesema watu wale amevanga ya kalawait alafu amejifunika kitamba kalawait alafu anafanya fanya tu something like you know ako to TV alafu anaimba line moja like the other day we were listening to a song and they only repeated one line the entire song Umwema, mm. the whole song. Mm. Umwe, I, get, like, I don't want to continue in the young girl, but I don't want to see Jenny in the young girl. But they repeated one line throughout the song. Mm. So is it from a point of laziness that mm. we are lazy, mm. as, a, as gospel musicians are lazy, mm. or is it from a point of rema, or is it that Pia, <laughs> wana sema tu ni huduma watu wata message. Unawana venye watu wana semanga, usisikize sauti, sikiza message. Yeah. Ah, my potential friends. I'm trying to say my evil. He's not ready for greatness. <laughs> Actually, you need competence. You need competence a lot. You see, these people, they think. No, YouTube ni moja. Akuna YouTube ya wasewa gospel na akuna YouTube ya wasewa secular. Ni moja. And what you need to do, okay? What I'll say, challenges are there. That's why me, my songs, I uh, I've taken time to produce. Uh, to give, uh, uh, to do video on them. These songs, my songs, I record three years ago, four years ago. But one thing God told me is that your music is, you have quality music. Don't, don't, need um, to word. Don't compromise on a, on, a, on a low quality video. Just wait. Yeah. So one of the things, what on Araka, especially the young people, they want, explosion they don't want the process you see na kitu ingine challenge na kuanga it's about money it's a lot watu wengi hakuna mtu atakwambia hata kama kwa kwa biashara atakwambia pesa pesa unadhani kufanya video quality pesa ngapi almost 40000 kuendelea yenye unaweza pata mtu amekurumia kabisa maybe 15 na hiyo 15 unafanyia indoors Yes. 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 Like mtu anakuambia tu hey barikiwa unaimba vizuri what are you doing after that because mimi personally ningekuwa na pesa vitu zingine ningejifanyia mwenyewe but wewe actually we just need God to speak to some people so that yeah like uh, anaona yako na hii song ana do afanye nini anafanya tu vinya anaweza you never know maybe mtu ataona hivyo na aseme ah oh, Ajafanya video mzuri but hiyo ngome kofiti I want to do a video for for the person you see then nini na toke hapo but na kuna wengine tu wako lazy lazy kabisa ameenda kwa producer mwingine huko anamlipisha nini 2000 ama 1500 audio audio na toke na leka kwa mtungi haitaenda pahali you see we need to tell them the truth go for quality things spend time hata fadhali utek one year una save pesa za audio na pesa za video quality na ikusaidia. Kwa hiyo song uwezi play, uwezi play kwa nini wao wote? Station gani itaruhusu kupigwa picha kwa nini? Wewe kufanya <laughs> kuchukua video na kwa nini imefanya hivi? No. 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 Na wengine wanadhani yango kivaa white ndio itatokea vizuri. Uongo. 
you just need to work wako deep yes. wako holy wako deep Ay. wako need alafu most of them they've compromised there's something one of my friends shared on our status akasema watu wanaenda kufanya audios wanalala na producers hizo vitu zita yenda pale i'm telling you the truth well, azita yenda pale getting pali. deep yeah azita yenda but we need to tell them the truth because because they need to know yes azita yenda pale hmm? foundation yake ni wrong <laughs> Can hear people in the studio are laughing. Foundation, <laughs> foundation yake ni kitandadi hata si kwa, kwa, kwa gospel. It's not. Hmm? That's why hata wanarudia hiyo word moja peke yake. Cuz hakuna content. Uwe. Yeye yeah, yeah, kitu anakumbuka tu peke yake venye walikuwa wameenda hiyo side gate ni hiyo tu. Ah. Karibu ni sema hiyo wimbo lakini. Yeah, but uh, they need <laughs> they need to know the truth, yeah sure. Actually ukiwa kwa hili ni he opportunities opportunities are there to compromise you ask me i'll tell you i was offered 100000 plus a good house and a, and a, and, a, and a car so that i just go to a certain church just to be there just be part of them ah oh, mean no no actually it's a good offer very good offer but with my destiny that's a compromise that's a compromise mimi hata kwetu church wanajua ati wakisema leo tunalipwa good siezi chukua hizo pesa nachukua na naso back because right now i'm not entitled to receive any money for my gifting na sijafika destiny yangu acha tu nipitie tu shida ni sawa but the sacrifice that i'm doing it's for my destiny people, people don't understand destiny that's why they will do anything they will go and do video tio yote kwa 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 mtaro pale ama kwa kadini pale ati maji waterfall hata si waterfall nile maji natoka hivi na ina <laughs> thank you for bringing thank you for bringing that story up so so you people mimi me i can tell you the truth mimi come and compromise ah ngamo compromise kitambo sana thank you for bringing it up mm. now that brings me to a question mm. i wanted to ask you okay um the aspect of being paid and being appreciated mm. in terms of gospel mm. um musicians mm. what do you think about it okay that that one is personal in fact you said that session yeah okay to some it's okay but to me it's not okay tell us especially to my church my home church ai ni kama wewe uende mtoni kwenyu kuchota maji unarudi naambia madhe eh hiyo hiyo mtu ni 20 bob so a hundred of them that's 200 na nakupea that's a curse you're receiving a curse receiving a curse so musicians should not receive um money from their churches or okay. what are you trying to say musician should but worshipers <laughs> like me please don't why because uh, there's something called sacrifice and something called destiny and once you understand this thing even about sowing seeds na nini you will know actually it's knowledge what wana knowledge but ukipo ukienda pahali na appreciation ni sawa but hata wakitumiaji na appreciation wanajoy ni kulipwa waache sawa bana Eh, 2000 hizi fanya tu atisi jini. Na hata hiyo pesa nyata si mingi. Ni 2000. 1 2000. Mm? So actually it's about knowledge anyway. I'm not singili watu wanalipwa na nini. No. Ukilipwa ni sawa kama God amekwambia hiyo si hata kuna wengine wanalipishanga kuingia worship experiences. Eh, but mtu kama mimi siezi lipisha. Ni juu ya covenant yangu na God na destiny yangu na God. So these things it's a matter of How has God called you into this? Kuna wengine umeitwa hapo juu ya do na kuna sisi wenye tumetoa juu ya souls. Yeah. So ata, okay let me tell you the truth. Even if you invite me to your church then you pay me 1 million and I don't deliver I won't take that money. I won't take. Because my joy is to deliver what I have to a generation. You see? Yes. 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 Nice, nice. Um the aspect of fatherhood mm. um in terms of musicians we see a lot of a lot of um, worshipers when you ask them um wh- where they begin at they mm. began very well mm. they had a father they had a covering kidogo kidogo wamejulikana they no longer want to go to that chachao ya ghetto you know they they now identify with the big pastors they who is who what do you think about that walianza na roho akamaliza na mwili ni sawa but one thing i'll say mm-hmm. actually it's knowledge 
maybe kuna mtu alitoka church kwanza ladies i have very many cases so many ladies, they are my friends they always say that hiyo hiyo pasa alikuwa ananikatia hey sijui nini nini my friend ni sawa tu acha kwanza ni sendeo direction fatherhood and son it's it's important hata jesus mwenyewe alikuwa na father ndaka hata alikuwa anasema i'm doing the will of my father so covering is very very important especially if you're a man of destiny and a man of generations me i'll tell you the truth and uh, uh na fatherhood and sonship is a matter of heart to heart heart to heart heart to heart whereby mimi was in the okay very many people come and ask me how did you find yourself to this church or spiritual father yes jinini i tell them listen from god usiamke tu kesho na sema naenda hiyo church na kusubmit hapo utakuwa hapo kae useme hapo siku yako tena utoroke sasa utakuwa mtu wa kuhamama kanisa utaekwa hiyo jina na mimi hata kwako si ni mbaya stay with god in fact uh, tem god alikuwa na shift anani shift life yangu na ministry this one time i said one year without going to church so I was just staying and praying to god god direct me direct me where i'll go uh, for my next season that will be beneficial to my destiny please so i stayed and i had two options in my mind kuna church yenye niko sasa hizi zo worship center kino na kuna nyingine yenye sitasema yenye nilikuwa nafikiria nisenda huko ama niende huko but wao huko walikuwa wananifuata sana ai nikasema hapana so ningambia god you just give me so i went to that church the first day no one sunday went there kangalia vitu zenye wanafanya the whole service na nini aha next sunday nikaenda huko kingine na huko ndo nikabaki I found my spirit just there. Wow. So these things unless God aku confirm me don't be in a hurry. Don't be in a hurry. Don't be in a hurry especially young people because your father determines a lot. The same way Jacob ange ange tell about their children. This one will go far. This one uh uh-uh. uh this one uh uh-uh. this one I give you the fatherly blessing even the spiritual fathers wako. Among sans wake wote anajuanga nani ameitiwa generations na nani atabaki tu hapa church na nani yako ngi serious yes they know so have a person mwenye ni father hata kama akulipi ka hapo ka hapo get covering yes you stay there you, you see these people don't understand covering do you know what's covering eh? tell us covering hata hata shule ulikuja cover kitabu unapigwa kwani hata hiyo peke yake ndio inafaa ikoonyeshe <laughs> how important cover iko you see there are places we we invited and maybe our stretch in the spirit cannot fight whatever is being imposed to us in those environment but because we have a covering hi una enjoy it una the name where god anakusaidia kumbe kuna lakini hao wengine wanagongwa wanagongwa you see in this world of 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 Very many people see us go to Kisumu, go where, go where, go where. We are here. Very soon we'll be going outside the country. So they think it's just going. No, we are fighting spirits. Eh? Na ki spirits kinaweza kutupea tu ki alsa. Pa! Ama kutupea tu cancer tu. So we are kuja kusumbua territory yetu hapa. Ama unatupiwa wanawake 132. Mm, ki spirit ki morality kinaweza kushika. Even in the example I refuse. So ukitupoma vitu kaa hizo stacha yako maybe your prayers and every uh, everything i jako in a good position to to mm. to, 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 to do away with them but because you have a covering yeah. na pia itaficha nakedness yako covering pia inaficha nakedness yako okay. kuna ujinga unakuanga nayo yenye bado ujako enlightened spiritual father aka tawana so <clears throat> personally there's some things mimi na hizi mioto zangu ningekuwa nimeingia kwa era mimi nilikuwa nataka nilikuwa nafanya meetings county after county kwenda mzee wao kanaambia eh 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 so we are taking Kenya for Jesus nimekuja ah mzee kanaambia cool 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 this and this and na alinisaidia sasa hizi ndio naona alinisaidia sana ningeanza eh hata siji siji so you see kuna knowledge na kuna vitu zenye hawa na jua na wamepitia wanajua kichukua hiyo njia 
tutaangoka lakini wewe unaona uko na followers 132 on Facebook yes YouTube sijui nini TikTok my friend waje sikuzita hakiwa zote urudi chini ndio utajua father huyu ni nini actually mimi yeah. kuna time account yangu karibu ihakiwe but because of father fatherhood niliambiwa during a prayer meeting Hillary pray for your YouTube channel it's going to be hacked pray about it na mabishta zangu zilihakiwa ha ka 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 wote but yangu ka survive just because of fatherhood yes so inasaidia nga vitu mingi sana na si fatherhood kulipia rent Eh hey, si father do kulipia rent ni wa to deal with your spirituality. <laughs> Unajua watu wanasema um, ngati okay your spiritual father is responsible for your spirituality not your needs ama nini. Akienda kwa your needs then wewe ni mzuri kabisa. But their boundary ni wewe una grow as spiritually. To escape your point boundary ni where you're growing spiritually. So I, I that project you're working on right now. Mm. Yeah 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 I'm planning I'm planning to do a live recording and also um, but first I'm planning to do events a worship night. Yes it's called the Zion edition one of the pro, one of the visions God has given me Zion edition. So the Zion edition will be doing annually now by the grace of God and uh, it's just to gather worshipers and just come and just be in the presence of the Lord the whole night. Is only meeting in ukikuja tu hivi kama umelala hivi utaamka ni five fast boy you to to raise dimension up higher 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 and higher and higher so yes. I'm, i'm 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 planning i've, I've not yet talked with my spiritual father so i won't expose much about that because okay. of honor but i'm planning to do it probably on december yeah okay. yeah so more details will be out on all my social media platforms but uh, iki iki kuja mkuje Hey, mkuja 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 tuwapige oligos tutakuja we will come sawa sawa where, where, where do you expect to be in like five years hey kai me i'll be i'll be influencing the whole the whole world with what god has given me yeah amazing the so whole world i want us to gi- i want you to give us a parting shot yeah i want you to talk to someone out there who's watching you this morning okay nana feel is this everything i can do right now mm, god mm. is this whether it's in music life business wherever <coughs> mm. family children mm. is this everything there is to life yeah okay so you are there you are listening to me <laughs> i want to tell you something that do what god has called you to do even if it's in ministry life education just align with what god has for your life that's the way for victory it's not by our intellectuals it's not of our qualifications but what god has told you to do maybe it's in business <coughs> and god has called you to sell those dasani waters please do it that's where your reality dwells in those in ministry i will tell you one thing focus on what god has deposited in your life and much more embrace growth the young people like me god has given you a gift in you please work on it work on it start start doing something about it don't worry that you're not known yet no you just do it and focus on on growing day in day in day in as cause as time goes by and god will uh, god will do so very many things and marvelous things in your life so don't give up don't give up now if you give up who will take over from there no one else and uh, time is coming and jesus christ is coming very soon So and our 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 tags will be the souls of people in our life. So you you can't give up. Don't give up. So keep doing what God has called you to do. That's where lies your reality. God bless you. Amina, thank, thank you. you so much. Thank you for coming. Asante. Thank you for your time. Thank you for the nuggets of wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> So I feel edified Thank you know you. and I hope you're also feeling edified at home that was Hillary the worshipper a uh, worshipper in this generation that God is raising to walk in great dimensions and depths and I hope you have been edified you have learned you have known a couple of things na mesema especially when you're going in the church uh, the spiritual cover is not to meet your needs they are to cover you not Sungojea kupepe salafu wakati ya kupepe so unasema to you uh me I need to go to where I'm giving money you know yeah but don't touch the dial we're coming back with more
maisha yangu ni salama.